what's going on guys so let's be honest here i'm a little bored on what's going on inside of the game right now uh we're doing a little bit of this tower defense game mode right now because there's nothing else that i really want to do wild brawl did just drop into the game today but we're still awaiting that special event that's coming that we can't wait to see so that we can kind of see what's up with the boss that we're gonna have to take down maybe give us some hints onto what's coming inside of the game figured i'd kind of take you through as i do a little casual mode right here which i do find quite fun and i find myself missing it i don't often do it and i want to show you how i see success i come here with a bolt caster i put all bolt casters up top i think they're good i like them i come in with a slowing tower right here in the middle and i essentially do the same thing for all of the lanes and then i come in with a lightning tower in the back that's my go-to setup but what I do also is I come with all of these towers, these energizing towers. And I like these because then I could just continuously build up energy while the lane is not being used. So right here, I will go with another lightning tower. And then I'm going to come remove this one because this lane is now active. We're going to remove it, get our coinage back, and we'll drop in the frost tower. And then we'll come over here. We'll get this back. Uh, hello. It's a little wonky on PC, let's be honest. It is not the smoothest to click on the buttons. And here, we're going to go with another Bolt Caster. The Bolt Caster is the first one that I upgrade all the time. I try and get that up to level 3. I try and get this up to level 3 before we go crazy and do anything else. Because we have one more lane that we're going to have to defend. In the meantime, though, can we, we have 10 of 10 structures up. So we got to make sure... Uh-oh, hello. Let's go here. Yeah, see, this is one of those moments when uh, it just doesn't go as planned. There we go. Upgrade this. Can I do it again? We'll upgrade it again. You know what? I'll probably take this to four so I don't have to come back over here. That's... Did I even... Did I even do it? Nope. There we go. Come on. So lucky. There we go. Up to four. We'll do the same here. We'll get this up to four. Boom. And really, I, I typically like to get these up first, but because I was back there, I don't want to have to travel down this lane again. Figure we'll just kind of do it like that. Let's get another one of these. This one's up to four now as well. Now, we have wave three coming. It's going to start coming down here. Notice we have these towers over here, the energizing towers. Four of them just dropping me more energy, allowing me to create more and more so that I could, you know, progress the upgrades on all my stuff. This is, a, this is how I do it all the time, by the way. All right, let's get out of here because I think we're going to be coming down this lane as well. Yep. So here, I go with the bolt caster right here. Put it right here. This, this lane is the most difficult lane to defend from what I've found. I go over here. Uh, hello. It would help if I could get this done quickly. A frost tower. And then I go lightning right here. Remove. And we're going to drop that lightning tower. I'm going to upgrade the lightning tower a few times if I can. There we go. And I'm going to go with the bolt caster next. Honestly, the bolt caster is not expensive. And it's a good upgrade in my opinion. Now, we still have one of these energizing towers doing its thing up there. I'm going to come right here as well. Try and get another upgrade on this. Now, remember, we're getting energy as we kill enemies. We're getting a little bit from that last little tower that we have too. Let's slow things down a little bit. We get a little damage from the slowing as well. Can we get this all the way up? We'll wait. I'll wait. So again, the topic is not how do you do this game mode. The topic here is today that when things get a little stale, you got to find things inside of the game to entertain yourself while you wait. Last night, I finished up all my bounties. Last night, I finished up all my, my dungeons. Now, of course, I have some more that I could do this morning. Um... Last night, we did Heliquary. That's all good. We're nine levels above Paragon levels, so that's all good. I'm honestly feeling good about everything. So now here we go. What I'm going to do here is we're going to get rid of this last tower. This is the trick here. Here's the, here's the, the inside juice. And I go with a... Uh, where is it? It's the Flame Thrower. This can throw to all lanes. I like it. And it helps protect this lane just a little bit more because, honestly, it is the toughest lane. This is rank four. We'll get this ranked up a little bit more too. And then we got this lightning. Then we'll just go with the gust tower and we'll be good to go. That's how we do it. And this is a passive game mode that I just like. For those of you that don't know, I was a 
massive tower defense fan. Tower defense games, along with shooters, were my favorites of all time. Which is actually why I started playing Clash of Clans, because it's tower defense-ish, right? I guess so. So, I like this game mode inside of Diablo Immortal. Is it the best? No. Is it good? Yes. Is it easy? Yes, it's pretty easy as well. Oftentimes, if, if I get my beacons down, the energy beacons in time, when I'm playing on mobile, I'm a lot quicker. Um, I'll go for 100%. Like, I won't, my tower won't even get touched, or the portal at the end won't even get touched. This strategy is very good for a 100% success. But when I play on PC and these things just don't click the way I want them to click, it takes me a little bit longer. All right, that's it. We can't put any more towers down. We're on wave five of five. We'll collect all of our rewards once they come. Nice little good amount of stuff that we get dropped over here. And then we go on and enjoy the next hour of our day. We're going to do some bounties. We're going to go running some uh, running some dungeons, claim all that stuff because we got to do our three dungeons for the day. We don't want to get behind again. You know, we want to be able to keep up with, with the grind. And then in an hour, I will be notified that, hey, you have a bunch of rewards that are hanging out over here. So I go and I collect everything. And that's it. That's what we're doing. Because, as I mentioned, not much else right now. Going into the events for the day, Wild Brawl, which I do have to mess with it. I can't play it on PC. I will lose. It will look bad. Tower War, I'm good. Hungering Moon, yeah, I think we claimed everything, actually, from Hungering Moon. Yeah, we got them all. All the rewards, all of everything. I mean, we're looking real good. We got the victory over here, too. Love this game mode. Uh, actually, I like I like this game mode. Let's let's be honest. I like it. I wouldn't say that I love it. Oh, my inventory's full? Well, let me show off my pet here. We'll salvage equipment with my pet. See you later, equipment. And now we can pick up all the stuff that we want. We're going to clean up all the mess, and we'll come back later. Oh, there's a blacksmith here, too, which I don't need anymore because my pet's looking good. Speaking of, I could summon a pet, and I'm feeling kind of lucky. I'm feeling kind of lucky, so I'm going to do it with you guys. Because I'm getting the vibe that I'm going to get something good. I'm getting that vibe. So let's actually head back to Westmarch. We'll get out of this. We'll exit. Let's head back to Westmarch. Actually, can I just go to my, my pet contract and take me right where I need to go? Let's visit the summoning portal. Let's go do it. While we do it, I'm going to take a sip of coffee. What? Get out of here. Seriously? Come on, dudes. Drop all the skills. Now we'll get out of here. Just just slowing me down. Just trying to take a sip of coffee here. By the way, I typically stream on Saturdays. But this Saturday, uh, I have a soccer for my son in the morning. And then I have a birthday party to take him to. My stream may be a little bit later on Saturday. I'm still looking to do it, though. So... Stay tuned. I'll keep everyone up to date with when the stream is coming if you want to come through and see what's going on. We have one summon right here. What should we draw today? Tell me you don't draw stuff. I I do. We go, we're go. we going to go with the Mickey Mouse. I find when I draw things, I have better luck. We're going with the Mickey. Give me something good. It's not. I lied. It's not something good. Let's actually see one last thing while we're here. I have a bunch of stuff that I could use to upgrade. So let's go here. Let's throw a little bit of juice into him. Let's empower this bad boy. We got to empower him up. Boom. This is typically what I do with my pets. This one's not the worst. And now what I'll do is combine. I'll convert. And we'll add a few more familiars. And we'll hope that we get something good. So we'll go like this. I'd love another brood talon. I actually would love to have a legendary brood talon. Or the cat. What do we get? Okay. Oh, we got one skill on. Now I can sell this thing for what? 8,000 platinum? Still not really great. Can we continue converting? Can we put something else in? Nope, there's nothing else for him. Let's convert something else. Let's see. Oh, switch familiars. Nope, can't do it. I got to go back to the other screen. Is there anything that I have? A lot of level ones. I may as well level up the level ones and start to try and convert them into stuff. Don't have much besides my good things over here. We've done a lot of converting and putting stuff together. And essentially, got my cat there too, which I kind of like. I, I really do like the cat. I like the extra shielding you get. But this guy's not so bad. Also, this guy's not so bad either. He like sucks everyone in and then slaps you around a little bit. What do we get here for skills though? 
Uh, nope. Nope. Razor Claws. Nope. Rapture. I have not gotten one of them. That actually helps out in PvP. Not one. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you're having a great day. I know that we just kind of hung out here for 10 minutes and were randomly talking about what it was. I was pretending that you were talking to me along the way so I didn't feel lonely. Hope you have a great day. Have a great Friday, a great weekend ahead. And very soon we'll have exciting stuff coming to Diablo Immortal. In the meantime, we'll just grind through our days and enjoy what we can. Take care, guys.